I welcome you to my short video about double entry for beginners. This is Senior Huntington, your accounting tutor. Now in this video, I'm examining the concept of double entry. Of course, a principle that is the foundation stone of accountancy. Now accounts are built on the double entry principle, which states that for every debit entry, there must be a corresponding credit entry. So in posting transactions into your accounts, you always need to identify which accounts need to be debited and which accounts need to be credited. Of course, this poses a bit of a challenge to people who are new to the accounts or people who have not learned the basics in accounts and are now doing a professional accounting qualification. Now, a common acronym used to learn double entry is dead click. That is one of the acronym which we use to learn double entry. So I'm going to teach you what dead click is. Now we have dead, D-E-A-D, -E D stands for debit. Okay. So expenses, assets, drawings, that is debt. So meaning that expenses, assets, drawings, we are going to see why debit. When it comes to click, C stands for credit, then L is liabilities, incomes, and capital. That is dead click. Now what is debt? What is click? Now, uh, when it comes to debit, expenses, debit, assets, debit, drawings, debit debit transactions. Eh? So expenses, assets, drawings, these are debit transactions. So if any of these are increasing, you will need to debit the account and vice versa if it is decreasing, that is debt. So we debit expenses, assets, drawings, whenever they are increasing. So you'll need to debit the account. And of course you have to credit the account if any of these is decreasing. Click the credit transactions, liabilities, incomes, capital. So if any of these are increasing, you will need to credit the account and vice versa if it is decreasing. That is the dead click. It's one of the common acronym we use to learn uh, double entry. This is Senior Huntington. Bye-bye. Thanks for watching.